Rashid Afridi, the new man in for a hundred in the last outing. Now this is far too wavered. He's gone straight. There's a man at on just wide of Irfan Patan. He struck flat. He's left-handed as well, so it was going to his strong hand, but not close enough. And over bit off. He's not going to mess around. Can see the boundaries, three of them. Mid-off is a lot closer than mid-on, so he has a better chance of going over the mid-off fielder. And that's where he went on this occasion. Well over the top of mid-off. Very safe shot. Well, finds almost the sweetest spot in the bat. Swings it down there for four. Why he hasn't got a third man? He's got me absolutely beat. I know he's got a deep point, but maybe he might be better at having a wide third man. That's well played. Another boundary, and that brings up the 300 for Pakistan. Oh, what a sound from the willow. Still has enough to get to the fence, and he also gets to his 50, Shahid Afridi. Eight this match 50. Oh, he can hit the cricket ball, and he can do magic. And it's about time. Where you been? There is the man in the deep, but he's going to be a mere spectator. Harvajan Singh was a deep square leg. Was interested for just a moment, but after that, it was the spectators who enjoyed the show. Didn't he get all of this? He has smashed this. Right in the screws. Look out, folks. Look at it go. Duck, for God's sake. Someone, oh, they're clearing the area. It's his 41st six and test cricket. Oh, he's got all of it. He knows it. He can't bowl short at 120 clicks to a guy and expect him to get away with it. Where it's going, going, gone. Wow. Isn't he a great player? when he's like this and he's played so sensibly today and he keeps bowling short with two back and he's got all of this when you're playing cricket at the highest level you've got to learn quickly and this has happened that's gone that's four more to Shahid Afridi that's gone a long way up the bit off his back is he far enough back he isn't one bounce. And again it defeated Rahul Dravid's field placing. Where has that gone? How many rows back? That brings up the 100 for Shida Freedy. Simon Toffel isn't absolutely sure if it has gone all the way or not. Whether it's a 4 or a 6, it's his century. Well, that was rather comprehensive. Short ball, bouncer, which didn't get up, and at that pace, was just meat and drink for Afridi. That's going to be called six, certainly. But, but it went right over. It's been signaled as six now, right from the middle of the bat. Fifth test hundred and this is his third against India. He does relish the Indian bowling.
Back to back centuries for Shida Freedy. It's 406 for four. Good fortune again. Very fortunate, Shida Freedy. Inside edge, perilously close to those stumps. Edged, but gone through between Downey and BBS Lakshman. He's coming off just 125 balls. Can get confusing out there. He's trying to work out where he can hit a four or a six at the moment. Maybe, maybe there. That is pure violence. Nothing else but. Here we go. And he's going for it. It's in the air. And incoming Uvraj. He should get this. And takes it. And Earl Crumbly gets a wicket. Shai the Freddy gone for a blistering 156. It's now 467 for five. 